Hello everybody and welcome to Conspiracy Crypto. I'm the host with the most, Tobias Brown. I hope you're doing all right out there in crypto land. Wow, is all I've got to say. Wow, wow, wow. What a week. We are well and truly above the $45,000 danger level for Bitcoin and things have moved in such a massive way. I mean, you've got XRP up nearly 50%. Huge. Cardano, 34% up. Look at these charts, guys. Wow, okay? There is a big uptick in the crypto market. There's lots of reasons. It's been suppressed for so long, as I've been telling you on this channel. Um, John and Dave and everyone else from Dean Witter, Bear Stearns, Morgan Stanley, they've filled, they've filled their boots already, and the market can now take off. Now, this doesn't mean there's not going to be corrections. Guys, look out for the corrections. There will be a correction coming, in my opinion. Keep your money ready for that. Um, are we going down to the levels we were at? No, I don't think so. Are we going down to probably half of it? Yeah, I'd expect so. So you can expect Bitcoin to maybe shoot up to about 50 and then drop back down uh, or even stay at this level and then start slowly dropping down and the market following it. Um, I see XRP getting to about $1.15 and then we see another drop. Uh, down to those levels again because they want to shake people out again. Um, be careful is all I've got to say. Now, what I wanted to talk to you about today is an investing strategy I've used very successfully. Uh, and it's something that I really I really do well with crypto at. And it's, it's something I use during bull markets like this. So the bear market, obviously the strategy doesn't work. But in a bull market, it's something that you should really take a look at and uh, I'll just, I don't know what, what I call the strategy other than uh, look and see. That's all I call it. So I had $200 earlier. This is my crypto portfolio. This is just one of my portfolios. It's just a small one. Um, if you want to get yourself a crypto portfolio like this, you, and you're Australian, this is an Australian one, you go to coinspot.com.au or uh, I'll put a link in the description below and you'll actually get $10 in free Bitcoin if you're interested in getting this particular um, wallet. Okay, this particular exchange. So, what I did, now you probably won't agree with me, but what I did was I bought a shitload of Shiba Inu. I bought 200 Aussie dollars worth of Shiba Inu. I'll show you if I open the wallet. Let's have a little look here. And uh, trade history. Just to prove a point. Yep, there you go. So I bought 200 Aussie dollars and I got 17,937,219 Shiba. Woohoo! I already had like $34 worth of Shiba in there. But the reason I bought this is because it's a very simple, it's a very simple mathematical thing, okay? If the market has already gone up as high as it's gone and shot up to those levels then you do not want to be buying stuff which is already up, okay? Now, I already own Zinfin. I own loads of other cryptos as well. Um, but I don't want to be buying XDC Zinfin when it's massively up. I don't want to be buying Wink. I mean, I would have bought Wink, to be honest with you, if I'd been a bit smarter and had my money earlier. Uh, I would have been in on Wink, and I would have got that 45% return on it. But it's a risky strategy. So what I do is I look for the absolute best scenario. So the best scenario I found was Shiba Inu because it hasn't really pumped yet. Everything else has had massive major pumps. Now if we have a look at all the wallets, I mean look at this percentage change in 24 hours. Zinfin's up 21%. You do not want to be FOMOing into a coin when it's up 21%. You are going to get wrecked, okay? Now, Shiba Inu, 2.68%, Stellar, 8%, XRP, 17%. You see, why would I get into these coins when there's so much up? Now, the only one which isn't up that much, I mean, that you could have gone for Axel Infinity down 7%, and that's also a really good strategy. If something's massively down and you trust the project, like Sandbox, you could get in now 6% off. But if you have a look at what Sandbox has been doing on their chart, you'll see that although it's only it's 6% down now, look at where it's come from, right? 
So it's come from a massive amount. Yeah, yeah. It's still, it's still, it's still down from where it was, obviously, uh, before the crash. But it's still a massive amount down. So let's just have a look at what's been going on. So if you go along to CoinMarketCap.com and you have a look at all these different cryptos, all right. So what I do is I try and find something which hasn't had the pump yet. So Shiba, if I show you their chart. Yeah, it's up 28% from where it was, but 28% is not actually that good compared to where it should be. So the reason I chose Shiba is based on this chart. So I just want to show you. Hang on. Ooh. Where's my chart? Uh, do, 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 do. Why is it doing this? I'm not showing me a chart. Buy. Shiba Inu, rank 41. Hmm. All right, overview. That's why I run the market for some reason. All right, here we go. This is what we want. So look, yeah, this was Shiba Inu when it was first released. This was the massive pump we had in May. Bang, it went all the way up to, you know, 0.00032. But the point is, Shiba Inu, in this run, this new bull run that's happening, has only had this little pump here. Okay? It's still very much undervalued compared to where it was. Now, if we compare that with something like Cardano, or VeChain, or anything else that's had a massive pump recently, well, let's just take... Let's take Cardano as an example, right? Cardano is still, on its chart, absolutely tearing. I mean, I'm not saying Cardano isn't a good investment. It's a fantastic investment. Not financial advice, but yeah, if you haven't looked at Cardano, you really need to think about it. And I recommend everyone own at least a thousand Cardano in their portfolio. Come on, coin market cap, do what you're supposed to be doing. Right, you look, this is what I'm trying to say. Okay? This is where we got to with Cardano. We got all the way down to about a dollar five cents. And now look at the pump. Look at that pump for a dollar eighty three. That's absolutely massive pump, right? So now it's pointless getting into Cardano unless you have a bit of a drop. If you have a bit of a drop, now's the time to be getting into it. But with Shiba, it hasn't had this pump yet. It's had a tiny little blip, which means all this upside, as long as the bull run continues, is still to come. So it's well worth getting in because you can double, triple, or even quadruple your money really, really quickly overnight on something like that. So I'm just, I don't have a name for this strategy. I'm just going to call it Toby's altcoin strategy for quick returns. Um, but it's really, really simple. All you need to do is look at the charts, find something which you like the look of, which hasn't pumped yet everything else has. And you bet your bottom dollar that coin is going to pump at some point very, very soon. All right, so... Again, if you're interested, go along to get yourself a CoinSpot account. Please like, subscribe to all my videos. Really appreciate it. Helps grow the channel. And also, if you haven't done it yet, you need to look at Nexo. Um, get yourself a Nexo account. I have a link in the description below as well. You get up to 8 9% on all your crypto assets so you can put it's like a crypto bank you can put your money in there plus you get ten dollars in free bitcoin just for signing up as well and so do i so it helps me it helps me grow the channel it helps um fund the channel as well all right so if you want to help out want to keep me going and uh want to be able to use these strategies i do start teaching i will start doing udemy very soon where i teach these strategies in depth but it's very simple Go to your account, have a look at what isn't, hasn't pumped yet to the same degree as everything else, but you know is a good project. Don't buy shit coins, guys. Shiba Inu, it's on the verge for me. It is pretty much a shit coin, but at the same time, it has big potential and it's, it's actually allied with a lot of other stuff. 
So there is massive, massive room for growth with Shiba. I'd recommend looking at it. Um, but do not buy rubbish. Do please, please, please. You know, all these um, all these different neighbor Alice and whatnot. I don't want to go into it, but a lot of them are just absolute guff. So don't buy it. You'll waste your money. But when you're looking for something which hasn't pumped, make sure it is a standard project. Make sure it's something which you believe in, you know is going somewhere, and you've done your research on. All right, guys, that's it for me. I know it's been a bit of a rambling video, and I'm sorry for that, and I haven't really conveyed myself as well as I probably should have done. But, yeah, you get the idea. So find something you believe in, you know is going to pump, and there is a bull run on, and just get into it early before it does that massive, massive move. So my opinion, I think Sheba's probably going to 100x um, from here into the future. But right now, if I can get just you know, a one or two X on my money, I'll be happy because it's just $200, which I had sitting around. All right. So wish you all the best guys. Take it easy. Um, do look at all the links, get yourself Nexo. It's well worth it. And also look at CoinSpot if you're Australian and have a look at all the links where you can buy the cryptos, which I talk about on this channel as well. That's it from me. Take care. Bye.